think where we are missing the plot is that uh, Ghana has gone haywire. Ghana has gone haywire. Yeah, we've gone haywire. How so? Um, there's so much indiscipline, and it creeps through the whole fabric of society. Indiscipline is at its peak, and I think that is why we are suffering. There's no discipline. There's there's no strong sense of, if I will, leadership that is taking control of things and saying, no, this can be done, this, can, this is what we want, and let's follow this path, you know. It's like, be I lose, Benjamin, you know. Everybody does practically what they want, you know. So I think, unfortunately, Ghana is at the point where, you know, we are going with the flow. Whatever you feel good about, just do it. And Wherever the waves hit us, yeah, we go. Yeah, because the system has become so tight, so everybody be quack, quack, quack. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you have to do something to survive. Mm. You have to do something to add to whatever you're doing now in terms of a regular income, or maybe you don't even need income. You have to do quack, quack, quack. I was born an incromised, and I believed in the, his ideals, and I've grown up to understand why he was looking at Africa at the broader level, and everything that he was thinking. I have my little disagreements with him here and there, but generally, my bias is that, you know, I was born an incromised, you know. And I think we, we, we strayed away from the direction that would have gotten us to where we are. Let's talk about the MPP for now, because they are the ones in power. And all I can say is that I'm very, 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 very disappointed that they lost the plot. They lost the plot. They lost the plot. Because the plot coming in was Ghana beyond aid. Hallelujah. That's what we need. Look, we are, I am 66. Ghana is what? Almost 66. Yeah. We've gotten to the age where we should do things beyond aid. We have to stop begging. We have the Beyond uh, baby steps. Thank you. And I was so happy when the president was talking to Macron and he gave it to him. And that speech, yeah, I, I think, speech. yeah, reverberated through the world, actually. Finally, somebody has risen up from Africa and he's going to confront this imperial, you know, Abrofu with the Abrofusem and their control. This man seems that he wants Ghana to take control of things. Let's go beyond this aid, aid thing. What can we do for ourselves? was lamenting that Africans were crossing the desert and going to do menial jobs. Why don't we create a healthy environment in Africa so that these young men can stay? And I was like, yes, we lost the plot.